Hi everyone, welcome back to TS Talks. Hope you're all keeping well. Now in this one, I'm just talking about um, MPs, um, of course, in this country. Obviously, in light of the current situation, um, you know, not just them, but many people are having to work from home. And, you know, in a different video, I'll be talking about um, my thoughts on companies putting staff into furlough and things like that. Um, but this particular article and stuff has wound me up is that MPs are going to get around £10,000 additional to help them work from home, to help them in terms of if they need stuff like laptops, stationery, all this sort of thing. And I think, well, they don't need £10,000 to work from home. Like the people that need, you know, any sort of additional money is the people like nurses and people that's on the front line in hospitals you know uh, i'm sure if you have to work from home in reality what what may you need printer scanner a computer that ain't no ten thousand pound and within it so that they're gonna have up until i think it was around january 2021 and you know there's not gonna be much in-depth checks on what or what they're spending the money on which i think is is bang out of order now a couple of days prior to this there was talks that oh now's not the time to talk about pay rises for staff in the nhs well it is because you look can't be getting this this quick 10k bonus yes there's not the same amount as mps as there are to staff but you can s- spread that money out evenly um you know because NHS staff do deserve a, a massive pay rise after this. And not only that, and some of them nurses and, and stuff that's been on the front line with a lot of these cases, you know, they're going to need a lot of therapy after this. You know, people don't seem to realise that, oh, yeah, they're doing their job, they're doing their job, they're paid to do a job and help save people's lives. And that's great. And obviously that's what they did sign up for. But, you know, something like this, which is unprecedented and that, you know, for some of them, it may leave them mentally and physically scarred and they're going to need a lot of help following this. But yeah, they're talking about MPs getting a £10,000 bonus. I Personally, I think it's ridiculous. I think it's bang out of order and I think it's a lack of, lack of respect. And, you know, prior to this whole pandemic situation, this is why you see stories of a lot of, you know, ex-nurses and stuff they leave and go and work in places like Lidl and Aldi because they you know they end up in managerial jobs places there you know they work easier hours and you know they're not as stressed out for their pay so you know it's something that I I definitely want to see you know gets revised I don't see why MPs need £10,000 to work from home when like I said it's just a couple couple things you need to purchase and they're on decent wages anyway so you can probably purchase that off their normal wage but you know that's my thoughts on it obviously let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section below and if you haven't already done so go hit that subscribe button now and i'll catch you next time